thrifting. Thrifting time. Let's do it. Ready? Ben, you coming thrifting or what, dude? <laughs> Gotta put on my shoes. What's up, guys? What's going on? So today's gonna be a thrifting video. We're gonna go to hopefully, I think Goodwill, maybe Salvation Army, maybe another Goodwill. We might hit three stores, but. All the Goodwills. We got Mochi with us today. We got Ben, that's my younger brother, with us. And um, every time that Ben's here and comes thrifting with us, as long as he's got some polo bear on, we usually find some stuff, so. Where's the bear? <laughs> the polo bear, the ski bear. <laughs> I like it. All right, and then Allie's putting on her Tommy for your mommy shoes. I didn't even notice Allie's full Tommy'd out. Look at that, little box logo, nice flannel. The kicks. You clean those up nice, babe. I know. And that old lady fanny pack. Woo! <laughs> that thing is sick. And I've just got on the Star Wars Ewok shirt, so we're ready to go. Let's go hit the first, uh, to the Goodwill first. Yeah, let's go. All right, Goodwill. Let's see what you've got today. In Bodogs we trust. Oh, that's cool. It's what size nice, is that, large? Nice material. Huh, I like that. Nike shirt. We found this. Happy Ollie Days shirt, which we have a friend whose name is Ollie, so we're gonna get it for him for Christmas. And then, where did that Astros one go? Oh, there we go. It's a vintage Astros, Houston Astros t-shirt for, I think it's from 2000, yeah, 2003, $3. That is me. Thank you. <laughs> Found this really cool Vince sweater, but, and it's cheap too, it's a really nice one. But there's a big hole in the back. Oh, oh cool. the Muppet shirt. That's nice. <laughs> oh, there's those slime shirts. The Nick Slime Time shirts. I think these are, yeah, these are different ones. Were they size smalls? I found two more of them. Cool. Oh, that's actually, that's a pretty cool uh, bull shirt. Chicago Bulls. That's a pretty nice Oakley shirt. $3 and there's like a huge Oakley thing on it. What do Oakley, what do Oakley t-shirt? T-shirts usually. I don't usually. sell the T-shirts. That's what I'm saying. I kind of like them. Did you find any over there? There was one. Was it like like as nice as this one? Uh -huh. I think that's probably worth a shot. What is that? I don't know. Weird. I thought it was Jordan at first. Huh? Maybe. Here, let me that's see. What size is it? On. It is. All in America. All in America. <laughs> We're going on that for Christmas. What size are you? It's a large yeah. as well. Maybe we can lot them together. You know. Hey. I'm looking here. Ah. I'm looking here. Ah. <laughs> Ooh, that bugle boy fit. I wish they were worth more money. They're cool. Yeah. What is that? Looks like an old label. Hmm. Oh, dude. Oh, it's peanuts. What? Oh. That is a cool graphic. Oh, we got a single stitch, dude. There's no um. There's no date on it, but look at that graphic. Yeah, Happy Trails. Oh, I like this shirt. I don't see any date on the back. Um, it is a, it's an extra large. I think it's too big for me, but I like that, dude. Front and back. Yeah, that's going in the cart for sure. Ooh, what's that, Ben? Some Orvis. Ooh, that's a nice Orvis shirt. Yeah, that's good. Do you know what this is? Philmont. It's a single stitch on a Fruit of the Loom best shirt. I have not heard of it. Made in the USA. I'll look it up. Something? That's nice though. I slime. like that. And five bucks. That's a good deal. Oh, another slime time shirt. On an express shirt. There's what? Two of them. It must have been like people that worked at the show. I think. Or this. That's interesting. Can we look them up? <laughs> I guess so. Yeah. Which one's better? Which one's better. Pink, pink Tommy. Pink Tommy. Or pink Polo. Ooh. Honestly, because oh man, actually, I like the I like the Polo better. They're both eight dollars though. $8. Yeah. I like that one more though. Yeah. <laughs> ben. I really like Some Burberry, but it's $13. Some Burberry. Hidden button Burberry. Oh, it's a French cuff. Mm -hmm. Dude, I don't know. Ooh. French cuff Burberry London. It's a nice fabric. $13. Let's take a look. Let's take I wish they were it had the um checker. Nova check, yeah. yeah. Alright, do you think it's do you think it's real or fake polo? <laughs> <laughs> How about now? Oh my. <laughs> this is that stuff you don't Dude, see in the store. That's definitely real, right? Yeah. Wow, I wish it was real. 
<laughs> You're weird. <laughs> I found you something. That's you. Wow. Isn't that cool? Ooh. You don't like it? No, I do, but you don't it like might the flowers. be a little big. <laughs> I don't know. Try it on. Oh, look at that zipper. What? I think it fits you. Yeah. I like it on you actually. Yeah, you look good. <laughs> Lots of bears. Oh. Look at all the bears. The bears. There's actually good money in plushes. Oh, he's actually pretty cute. Yeah. All right, we're going to look through the electronics and see if there's anything good here. What do you think, Ben? Oh, look. Do you want some feline cat ear headphones? Oh, no? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I'm not seeing much. Always look inside cases. What is this? Oh, it's a, it's like an old portable iPod thing. Some Oakley shorts, you see them? Oh yeah. I saw that O. How much are those? Four dollars? Oh yeah, I actually saw those last time I was here. <laughs> are these some Guy Fieri shorts? Oh, flavor, wow. flavor town shorts. <laughs> <laughs> look what Ben found. What? Four dollars for the pet safe? These are listed. Yeah, dude. Yes, that's a score. Good job. All right, all this stuff is going back. These are no's, and then this is our yes. Yes pile. Yes, yes. Yes! <laughs> you don't do that, you don't do that. All right, Goodwill was a success. Got a bag full, spent $40. Yeah, Goodwill. <laughs> onto the onto some more i guess <laughs> i wanted to show you guys this in particular because in the past couple videos i've said single stitch yep when it comes to t-shirts and we've got a lot of people that have asked us what's the difference between single stitch and double stitch so instead of just telling you i'm going to show you and we hope it helps and we hope it helps so usually with single stitch it's an easy way to tell that a t-shirt is vintage because most t-shirt companies don't use just one stitch anymore they use two so when i say single stitch i'll try to show you try to show you on the actual t-shirt where you can see like there is only one line of stitching only one line of stitching on the sleeves and then on the bottom of the shirt as well so anywhere there's like stitching on the shirt it'll be one line instead of two it's like this is a single stitch shirt and it is vintage and then this one here is a newer shirt and it is not single stitch and then on the bottom of the shirt as well there's two lines of stitching so that's what makes it a single stitch and a double stitch it's literally one has one stitching and the other has two so single and double pretty easy to remember but always remember that if you find a single stitch one it is vintage doesn't necessarily mean that it's worth a lot of money you still need to look up the graphic on it but a lot of the times it could be worth some decent money yeah cool it's an indicator it's an indicator exactly exactly so some decent stuff at that thrift store we'll show you everything at the end of the video um, we're gonna head up about 45 minutes north and go hit some more thrift stores all right stop number two is the Salvation Army Ben found overalls Tommy overalls oh, yeah. here one time Ooh. you ready babe mm -hmm. let's go get the goods what? the crash bandicoot shirt it's not old but it's still pretty it's so cool, cool. Look on the on the um, on the collar on the back of the collar. Yes, jeans. That's pretty sweet. And it has this too. Is it uh, down? Mm -hmm. See if there's down. What'd you find? All right, 100% leather. Casino. Oh, that's kind of cool. But guess how much? Whoa. Oh, I didn't even look at the price. How much is it? Seventeen dollars. It's eighty. Is anything half off? It's eighty percent down. That might be something. Yeah, it's cool. might, Let's you. see. Any good shoes? Those are Toms down there. Your Crocs. Toms. Some Thomases. Those are nice Thomases too. Let me see. Some, some ten dollar Thomases. Those are pretty nice. What else we got? What else we got, Ben? What are these? These are Tommy. <laughs> Tommy Hilfiger dress shoes. All the, Thomas. All the Thomases. Hmm. Got Not seeing much. That is a cool wetsuit though. See it? 
O'Neill. It's got those those nineties colors on it. Yeah, it's nice neon. Yeah. It's a roar shirt, but it's seven dollars. Let me see the back of it. Yeah, I mean that's a good one. This is this brand has done well for us in the past, but for eight or for seven dollars, we'd probably get like maybe twenty two to twenty five. The price has gone down on it now, so mm -hmm. put it back. There's a Marvel or Adventure Team shirt for seven dollars. Yikes! Yikes! Ben's got some finds. Yeah. So What'd I you get? This one be for you, Tommy. For that's you nice, but, but like I would I wouldn't wear it. Well, I'm just gonna. <laughs> don't, don't do that. <laughs> um, what else did you get? Oh, Nat Nest. Yeah. That's pretty good. Five bucks. Mm -hmm. It's not bad. I haven't seen Nat Nest in a while, I've actually. I've never found it. Really? Yeah. And then here's Pima Soft. Some Pima Soft Touch. Five bucks. Good. Yeah. Wrinkled. But I don't know. Some heat fun. gear loose. Five for. Yeah. It has underwear armor on the back, too. Does it? Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. Uh, what's that, though? Ugh. I didn't look for oh. Ugh. 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 <laughs> Dude, the prices are crazy here. I know. Allie pulled out a, a Sears um, flannel shirt. Sears. Sears, and it was fifteen dollars, dude. I don't think it was so. even fifteen dollars at Sears. I know, right? It's kind of a neat Paradise Found shirt. It's not like the best pattern though, and these ones are, these ones like they need to be good patterns for them to be worth it so I'll probably put it back some bathing suits Tommy Bahama relax not terrible this feel nice brandy Ooh. yes yes <laughs> what size is that one that's probably good then for five bucks heat gear under armor there's lots and lots of tommy bahama lots but ten dollars a shirt mm. what'd you find um yeah look there's a perimeter shirt that's cool i don't know if Allie likes panic at the disco enough to like her. <laughs> that's mine. she might like that that's a funny panic shirt <laughs> this is just a really cool brand pick dolphins harley quinn wow it's cool huh some G unit. Some G unit. <laughs> Look how big this shirt is. Jeez. And then this is Screen Stars Best. Wow. It's a Christmas yeah, Screen Stars. Huh. Is there a date on it? No. No? I thought you might like that shirt. Oh my god. It's Panic of the Disco. What'd you find? Oh, that's funny. It's Panic of the Disco? Yeah, I didn't know if you um, liked them that much. No price, but some athleta. Athleta? Nice. But I grabbed these. Maybe they'll give them to us for that price. What are those? Oh, similar oh, okay. color. Gotcha. So we're literally only taking two things from here. We got these Lulu Labin shorts and this Under Armour Heat Gear Polo. No, three. Oh, maybe the Athleta. Depends how much they want for it. All right, Savo's done. We're gonna go to another Goodwill really quick because we didn't find much stuff there. We only got three things. How much were those Athleta pants you picked up? Two dollars. Two bucks, so we got three things. Didn't spend too much money, but we want to go find some more stuff. But first, lunch, food, food. drifting. Oh, I'm so sorry. All right, let's keep going. The chicken sandwich. All right, you guys ready for the last stop? Last stop is the Goodwill. Let's go see. Nice dance, babe. <laughs> Some uh, some Nickelodeon Ninja Turtles. They're back chill. Yeah, of course. It's pretty sweet. Oh, dude, watermelon. Watermelon shirt. <laughs> oh, here's a Heat Gear Wolverine shirt. Oh, those are those are new too, dude. Yeah. There's tags on the sleeves, I think. Yeah. Okay. How much are they? They're Five dollars. I would say those are probably good. Star Wars with the Darth Vader. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Huh. That's a nice North Face shirt, but it's eight dollars. Huh. Outdoor t shirt. I might I might try it on for myself. Yeah. It's an extra large. I don't know, maybe. It's affliction? Yeah. Nice dude. Made 
it's not nice. Ooh, <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> this is a nice one. And then this I like one, that color. Pretty cool. Christmas Tommy Hill figure. Color. Christmas Tommy. But it is a boutique one. Eight bucks. I just like. The that's nice for Christmas though. Yeah. These are interesting. Look. <clears throat> the Tommy Bahama one, maybe. I'm surprised this one. I like that. I'm, I might try it on. Here, look. Look, there's like 10 oh. pairs of these shoes. They're all new. And they're that they're that Bates brand. Oh, yeah? Um, but they're they're 25 bucks each. Um, but I don't know. I'm going to look them up, see if they're, if they're worth anything. I found these, too. Kohan Zero Grand. Hmm. So. Some size 48 polo shorts. Pretty nice. Pattern's nice, on not Yeah. Yeah. Maybe a first for us. What is it? Oh, no way. Wow. Very cool. That's, That's nice, babe. Good job. Yeah, and then you ready? Ugh. <laughs> what is it? Ah! Oh, yeah, there was a clown shirt back there, too. I might keep this. Master's cup? That's awesome. That is needs to go in the trash. Taco? I don't like clown taco. Shout out, Shout out to Marty. Shout out Taco Stacks. <laughs> There's more. Right. There's more. Right. You found another one. More. Oh, you found two. There might be a fourth one, one somewhere. Maybe that's why they were donated. I'm sorry. Maybe. That's cool. Uh, number. Three of them. All right, guys. I think we are heading out. Done for the day. We did it. We went thrifting. How was it? It was okay. You're okay. No, nah, you're mm. better than okay. I'm you're okay. great. Aww. Trademark. You're great. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Yeah, we're done at the thrift store. This past, uh, this Goodwill that we just went to was, was all right. Nothing like amazing. Yeah. Um, but we did pick up some pretty cool stuff today. So when we get home, I'll rifle through everything so you can see it. So at the end of this video, we'll just go through everything that we found. But thanks so much for hanging out with us, guys. We really appreciate it. And um, if you like this video, Make sure you hit that thumbs up button. If you like Ben, make sure you hit that thumbs down, down, thumbs, <laughs> thumbs down button. Um, and if you like Allie, hit that unicorn button. And we'll. Oh, uh, <laughs> if only. We'll see you guys on the next video. Remember, right after this, we'll show you guys everything we got. So, but thanks for watching, guys. Peace out. Love you. Together. I'm Allie Roots. And I'm Ryan Roots. And together we are Rally, Rally Roots. Roots. I was going to try to switch it around and do. Allen Roots, Aller but that's weird. Rally Roots. Like Ali and Ryan Allen? Yeah. Allen uh, Roots? No, don't no. like that. You guys want us to change it? <laughs> Peace out, guys. Here's everything we found. Bye. Picked up this nice pair of men's Lululemon shorts, that Lululemon logo on the bottom. Good condition. Uh, they were fairly cheap. I think they're like $5. And these we usually get between like $30 to $40 for. Men's Affliction shirt. Affliction Live Fast on the back with like this big wings and Florida de lis graphic. These, the better, the more distressed they are, the better we do with them. And the bigger the size, the better we do with them. So this shirt we'll probably get in the mid-20s for. A nice little Disney Star Wars polo. This one is new. It's got the hanging tags on it still. And a Darth Vader right on the chest there. Decent, decent item. We actually got two of these shirts. And I think we should be able to get like... Probably $25 to $30 each of them. Picked up this cool vintage single stitch shirt. It is on a Screen Stars Best label. And I just like the logo. I just like the graphic on it. Freeport Tuna Club. I don't know what it's worth, but like I said, people are into these single stitch vintage shirts right now. So we'll see how much money we get for it. Favorite find of the day is this vintage Peanuts Happy Trails shirt. The color's cool. The graphics are awesome. That's the front of the shirt. And then the back looks like that. Again, another single stitch shirt, which tells us that it's vintage. Probably, I would say, like early mid 90s on this one. I really like this shirt. Um, again, probably, I would say, high 20s, low 30s for this one. Pretty classic Orvis button down shirt here. We like selling these dress shirts, they sell fairly well for us. This one, I'm not sure. Oh, it's a size medium. So I feel like we will probably get like, mm, we'll probably ask like $27 for it and we'll take around 25 bucks for it. Another single stitch shirt. This one is on the Fruit of the Loom Best Made in the USA t-shirt, and it is Philmont. Got a Philmont graphic on it. Um, again, I don't know. I actually looked this shirt up, and I think we should be able to get like mid-20s, maybe, maybe 30 bucks for it, but only time will tell on this one. Pretty classic Oakley Hydraulics t-shirt here. These we don't get a whole ton of money for, but 
I think we will probably ask like 20 bucks for it and we should get around there like 18, $20 for this one. We picked up this Lacoste size 44 dress shirt. It's pretty nice. It's like a checkered blue pattern, a little alligator stitched into the pocket. Um, these ones we get like $30 for. I think the last one we sold, we got around 33 bucks for. So if you can find them and they are genuine, they are still a good brand to pick up. It's a nice Calvin Klein men's dress shirt, brand new with tags, had a $95 price tag on it. And I think we should get like maybe 30 to $40 for this one, looking at some of the comps, but it's a decent shirt. It's not the best brand to resell, but because it's new with tags, that's why we picked it up. We did buy this men's Tommy Bahama, like minty green, 100% linen shirt. I only picked this one up because of the size, because of the size and because it's a nice long sleeve shirt. So this one will probably list around, I would say $27. And if we get like 23 to 24 for it, we will be happy. If you can find these and they are a decent size, the larger sizes sell better but they are Under Armour heat gear polos. If you can find these, they do sell pretty fast. Like this one here, because of the color and because it's in good condition, we should get around like $24 for it fairly easily. The big thing on these is to make sure they're in good condition because a lot of times there's like pulls on them or stains. So make sure you take it into good light and check the condition. We also got these men's Cole Haan Zero Grand shoes. Nice wingtip on them. They're in okay condition. The laces definitely are worn, but I still think that we should be able to get a decent amount of money for them. I believe we paid $15 for these things. And looking at comps, I think we should be able to get like... I would say 60 to $80 for them. We also ended up getting three of these Masters pint glasses, that Masters like golf logo that we like to pick up on t-shirts. We found three of the pint glasses. I don't know exactly what they're worth. I think I might actually just keep them for ourselves because there's only three of them and I would assume a set of four would sell for more, but I like it. It's cool. It's rare to find stuff that uh, has the Masters logo on it like that, so... I like them. And then lastly, for $4, Ben picked up this PetSafe Elite Little Dog in-ground fence receiver collar. This thing was, like I said, $4. And I would say he should be able to get like $60, $70 for this thing on eBay. I think they're selling for over 100 bucks on Amazon, but we're gated on it. But either way, he should make some decent money on this PetSafe dog thing. <laughs> and that's it, guys. That's all the stuff that we found today.